So hey, hello, good morning, guys, and this is Corning with Gautam. And guys, today we are sorry for the music. Today we are going to cover the level Mountain Mercenaries, which is after the level. Uh, what was the level again? Uh, it was. It is after. Yeah, Closet Commander. And yeah, I just keep forgetting things a bit, so let's just stop talking about me and let's get started with the level. So our goal is to defeat the ogres, and yeah, so you should summon and command so while you're gathering coins. So I just want to reload this so we can do this level together, and today, let's get started. So guys... We have to move to the nearest coin, and we have been doing that for ages, so without explaining that, I'll just keep that in. And if if you're seeing this for the first time, this may be a little bit advanced, so please look at my videos from Kitkar Dungeon to Backwoods Forest to Sarvin Desert, and then you can come to here. But you may not understand a bit of things because you may not see my last videos, but if you understand these, I have no problem, I can just explain them. So let's get started. And yep, so we have to just do the finders item thing, and then we do that because we've been doing that for ages. But now instead of move xy, we're gonna add hero dot move item dot pose because that's what we're using. So using it might give us a good pack practice. And yep, so this is like the summoning thing. And I will explain that in further videos, and I'll just give a small guide to the boss star. One, and then to two if we collect it, then to three, and then to four, and then to five. So, let's get started. So, you have hero gold, greater than equal to the cost of soldier, hero dot, mm, hero dot, oh yeah, hero dot summon. And then you summon the soldier, and then you have to loop all. So while soldier index, soldier index is less than the soldiers dot length. We've been doing this in Sarvin Desert, and now we enter. And next time we use the array indexing to create the variable soldier, which this guy already gave us over here. So all I want to do is just paste this over here so it like counts in the loop and has the certain conditions. And then yeah, we command the soldiers and if I move my picture thing over here, we have the command which is already given to us but it's in a comment. So we just have to like paste it and give the comment. I, I'll just explain what this is doing. So first we need three things. What? What are you commanding? Number two. What do you want the guy to do and where should it go if it's moving and who should it attack if it's attacking? So we command the soldier, we, do, we ask it to attack and we ask it to attack the enemy. And yeah, so that's how it works with just some arguments and variables. And I'll be explaining that in my further videos too. And yeah, so we have did the level and let's just submit this thing. And all we have to do is like wait for the submit thing to happen. It just summons a lot of soldiers and we got an error. So let's just look at what the error is and let's get the counter the proper. Oh, I forgot to add the S in soldiers. Now let's run this thing. And let's check if it's a success. It's a success. And it is, I think. Oh yeah, we forgot to increment the soldier index. Soldier index plus any page one. So that's why it doesn't run. And now we wait. And now I'll just keep my mouse thing back over here. And yep, yeah, I think it's a success because this thing is up and running and it's a success. And this thing isn't coming. Yes, it's a success. And this is the code. And this is how the boss star works, so it's just like a small sample. In further clouded mountains, we'll be covering more and get high level boss stars, which we can summon more stuff like archers, paladins, archer towers, which is actually in the build category. 
and yep so we can do a lot more things with bosters and i'll cover them in our further videos and guys don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe and bye bye have a good day and this is corning with gotham and i'm signing off okay